Oh, twisted or tangled web we weave, I should say. Okay, so I need to put this on here, clearly. No, they can argue all they want. I'm gonna keep an eye on this pork. Cool, looks like it's about time. I'm gonna try taking the paper out. Sweet of her to care, but I know what I'm- OUCH! It's not coming out. This thing's frozen stiff, I can't get it out. Alright, now that I've sharpened the knife... Yes, I cut the pork! C plus 10 plus F. I thought it was clever and funny. Okay, so that obviously means something to do with that coat. F. Okay, so it's only three digits. Well, that obviously ain't it. No, it did not. Yeah, it did. I thought that. Let's take a look. Voucher that says appetizer 9, meat dish 10, soup A, seafood dish F. Right, so I still don't know what C and F mean. Makes you think a poor college student has the money to do something like that. Okay, so let's see here. Oh, those are the number of dishes. Okay, okay. So then, what is C? That's seafood. Okay. So that's 15. Okay, these are meat dishes. Oh, I didn't even think of that. Base 10. Six letters added onto the normal number system after nine. A equals 10, B equals 11, C equals 12. So 12 and 15 plus 10. So 12, 15 plus 10, okay. So 37. Okay, I'm gonna try it. Nope. Nope. Huh. I'm obviously doing something wrong here. So maybe it's just entering them in. Places. One, four. Hmm. I'm doing something wrong here. What am I doing wrong? 
Oh, I know what I was doing wrong. I wasn't converting 10 to base 10. Okay. So then if I put all those together, it's 43. I'm stupid. There we go. Okay. And there's the card. That's what I thought. Cool. Saturn key card. It's worth a try, Junpei. Please work. Yay! All right. Creepy sound. <laughs> Judy. I think we've been here before. A metal grate stretched from wall to wall. Beyond it were two elevators and the entrance to the kitchen. The elevators are over there, so that means... We went into the kitchen through that door and came out on this side. That means the map was right. Looks like. Then let's use it to plan our next move. Next move? Yeah, we need to decide where to go from here, don't we? He's right. Let's get started. From the looks of it, there are four possible routes. Let's just keep it simple and call them A, B, C, and D. First, A and B. They both seem to connect to a room that looks L-shaped. Yeah, there were two doors. P-shaped, actually. And they're locked. But they were both locked. We couldn't open them. Now, Route C. This goes all the way to the main staircase. That means it's door five, one of the numbered doors. And do you think we would meet up with the other four after this hallway? Possibly. No, I don't think we will. Why not? Look, there by the stairs. See how the gate is opened? Oh, yeah. When we went into the kitchen, it was closed. But it's open now. Yeah, so they just came through here. What do you think here. that means? They opened it. Most likely. Well, at least one of them survived. And if we take Route C, we're going backwards. That would be pointless. Then that means... We want to take Route D. They all looked at the staircase, its lazy curve leading down, deeper into the ship. Route D, then. D it is. Yep, Route D. Then we're set. They jog down the stairs until they reach the sea deck. Everything looks okay here. Let's check the next deck just to be sure. Yeah, just like I thought, D deck is totally underwater. Just like the bottom of the central staircase. The water gazed back at them, its smooth surface like a great mirror. At least the water level hasn't really changed. Small comfort. May as well head back to Sea Deck. Hmm. What else is here? There are two elevators over there at the top of the stairs. Just like the floor above. Hold on. These are kind of different. See? There's a card reader on the side. Another strange mark. Hey, look! It's Lotus's symbol! Huh? See? It's the woman symbol with horns on it. Mm -hmm. That seems like... Slap. <laughs> oh, oh! Ouch! 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 <coughs> oh, he grabbed her. She grabbed his hair. She began to shake him violently, and he thought he heard a low growl coming from her throat. What was that about the mark again? Uh-huh. Nothing. <laughs> Such violence. Jinpei began to wonder if she was not the devil itself. 
With an uncomfortable smile, June spoke up. This is a Mercury symbol. The horns symbolize the wings on Hermes's staff. Hermes, yeah, that's Hermes, right. whatever. <laughs> if we can't get Very this different thing to work, these elevators aren't going anywhere. In other words, we need a key card with the Mercury symbol on it. Probably. I guess we can't get on then. Let's just disregard the elevators for now. How about this hallway on the left? Whoa, there's so many doors. They weren't sure how many, but certainly enough to be discouraging. Damn it. If we try and search all these, the sun's gonna go down before we've done half of them. I think the sun already set. I have a feeling this ship is the only thing that's going to be going down anytime soon. That's even worse. Well, we can come back to this hallway later. Let's check the hallway on the other side, shall we? <sighs> Time to head back to the stairs. To their right was a small hallway. And now the right hallway. Quickly, they headed into it. It was approximately the same size as the alcove in front of the stairs. The hallway led toward the stern, and at its end was a set of double doors. Uh, there are doors here too. Uh, well, I guess it's just four this time. Let's open them. All right, let's start with this one. Junpei nodded and grabbed the one closest to him. He gave it a small tug and felt it move. That's what she said. Huh, it isn't locked. I'm going to open it. Thrilled to have found an unlocked door, he threw it open. Junpei didn't know what to make of what he saw. What? Oh no, more doors. And beds. Three doors. Wow. More decisions. He simply stood, unable to speak. So guys, unfortunately, I'm going to have to call it an end to this recording right now. I'm going to go ahead and save. All right. Well, once again, everyone, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you're liking this one. Uh, it's off to a slow start. I don't know if it's as popular as Danganronpa, but believe me, guys, this one gets really, 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 really good. I mean, I love it, personally. I know some people might think it's getting off to a slow start, but stick with me. I promise. It'll be worth it. All right, but in the meanwhile, guys, thank you all so much for watching. My name is Kronos006, and I am signing off for now. Take care.